So here's how you know that you grew up in California because you look at these homes and you go, oh, they're only $2 million. That's not bad. Well, good morning guys so we are here at Catalina Island we are specifically in the town of Avalon in California and it's pretty much off the coast of Los Angeles and it's this beautiful little island uh, town very very cool um, lots of little shops restaurants there's lots of water activities you can do for the day there's hiking um, we are actually gonna be taking a golf cart ride tour around the town so super fun um, so we'll bring you along for that but I think right now mom and I are actually gonna go get lunch because I did not have breakfast um, so I'm a little hungry but we found this really cool place that I'm hoping is gonna be open uh, it's called the lobster trap and it's supposed to be really good so let's see uh let's go head over there we're gonna walk over because it's like a few minutes away from the port or the pier and we'll go get some lunch and then we'll show you the town Okay guys, so it's about 11.30 and mom and I are here on Catalina Island. We are actually at the Lobster Trap. Now this place was one of the highest recommended places uh, to dine when on Catalina Island. Um, so we thought we'd come check it out. It's super cute inside, obviously very nautical themed. It's kind of fun and kitschy. It's not upscale, it's not fancy, but they're supposed to have some really amazing fresh seafood. So um, let me give let me show you guys everything that we get. We're gonna have lunch and then we have a golf cart tour around the island. So let's eat some food and then we'll get the rest of the day going. This is a seared ahi salad. And look how much ahi there is. This is a lot of ahi. So seared ahi is just done on the outside and then raw on the inside. That is the way I like my ahi. I got Thousand Island dressing because can't always get Thousand Island dressing. I don't know if you've ever noticed that, but most restaurants don't have it anymore. And it comes with carrots, cucumbers, and tomatoes. I didn't get the tomatoes. Mm. Delicious. All right, so I ended up getting the lobster roll because you come to a place called the Lobster Trap, I feel like you've got to get the lobster roll or at least get lobster when you're here. So their lobster roll, it's chunks of lobster with a tarragon sauce, and it's actually served on a Kaiser roll. Let's give it a try though, it looks really good. I definitely made a good choice. The lobster is super fresh, very moist, very juicy, very tender full of flavor from the tarragon sauce. And that tarragon sauce is absolutely delicious. Tarragon has a little bit of a weird uh, flavor profile to it. If you're not familiar with it, um, maybe get the sauce on the side just in case you don't like it. But I absolutely love tarragon. And this sauce is to die for. I've been trying hard to die upon my loosens. Peace and together from okay so that in 75 island company put two thirds or the regalist i may say put two thirds of the island in their hands and since it's a non-profit they cannot benefit out of it right, right. so they 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 are in charge of that uh conserve the island as it is oh one third left was put in the is still in the hands of the Wrigley's, but now it's called Catalina Island Company. And the Catalina Island Company owns one third, and this is uh, a small part of their third of the island, including that gas station, and that's what we pay for gas. Never seems so hard, but you and I keep dancing in the dark. In the dark. We could sleep two thousand miles.
Well, this excursion was definitely worth it. We were in a golf cart for over two and a half hours, and we covered the entire island, except for the Boy Scout camp, which I don't know where that is. We saw a fox, and we saw a lot of deer, and we saw zip liners, the scariest looking zip line I've ever seen. And our guide was very knowledgeable, and we learned all about Catalina, and I never knew any of it. I did not know it was owned by the Wrigleys of Wrigley Gum and the Cubs. So it was really, really worth it. And I'm glad I finally got to Catalina after 40 years. Well, good evening, guys. So we are here at the main dining room again. It's about eight o'clock and it is um, formal night or dress to impress night as they like to call it. And so we are down here in the dining room. We are gonna have a delicious dinner because we are starving. And yes, I know, we had a snack, but somehow we took a nap, we woke up, and our stomachs act as if they haven't eaten in the past 10 years. So, mom and I are each getting two appetizers. We're each gonna get an entree and then dessert. And mom might be getting two desserts because she can't decide between two. So with that said, I will show you everything that we get and let's have some dinner. Okay guys, so we just finished up with dinner. It's about 9.30 and there's not actually anything going on that we wanted to go to um, as far as like shows or activities. So we walked around a little bit on the promenade, um, but I'm just heading back to the room because I actually have to get a lot of work done. I have a lot of editing I need to get done. So um, I'm just gonna go back to the room and get that started, work on the laptop for a few hours, try and get some more videos done for you guys. And so this is gonna end day two of our cruise here on Navigator of the Seas. I hope that you guys enjoyed coming along with us to Catalina Island, and of course, seeing all the food that we had. Um, tomorrow is a sea day, so tomorrow we have a lot of eating to do. So I hope that you are gonna be nice and hungry. We're gonna show you the breakfast buffet at Windjammer, and then we are also gonna be going to a couple of the um, kind of like specialty dining spots on the ship just to show you what they're, what they're like, and maybe do a little bit of a small plates food test. So with that said, guys, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please make sure to give it a big thumbs up. And I would love if you would subscribe to the channel. And as always, I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye.